Hi everyone, good morning. It's Kate uh, from GetSeeFit.com. But more importantly, it's Kate, a girl who has something to say today. <laughs> um, let me put my e-break up. All right. Life-changing experience happened last night. I spoke in front of 500 people. They didn't, nobody came to see me. Trust me. Okay? Let me just put that out there. I went to a, a book lecture. Um, a book called May Cause Miracles that you need to check out. Um, because it'll, it'll change your world. It'll change your perception, which will change your world. The more worlds that are changed, the world can change at large. Anyway, I was there. And something inside of me, they did like a question and answer with Gabrielle Bernstein, who's the author, um, and opened up to conversation. So uh, I just had this like gut feeling like, you need to raise your hand, girl. Like you need to say something. Say something, ask something, whatever. And, um, you know, some people were talking, like they had taken some questions, 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 questions. And I was like, I don't know if I really have a question, but I have something to say. Um and so I raised, raised my hand and then I put it back down because they picked somebody else. And then she's like, let me take one more. That girl who raised her hand in the, in the white because I was wearing cream or something yesterday. And I was like, oh my God. <laughs> now what am I going to say? <laughs> and instead of freaking out, instead of, you know, just saying what, what um, would easily come to mind, like, thank you for writing your book, blah, blah, blah. I said how, it, how her books and the way that she thinks has completely affected the way that I think so much to the point that my life has changed and I can't go back. So I talked about it, how I ran down, I'm skipping now, skipping down. It's about the books about like happiness, um, unlimited happiness and, um, being, living a miraculous life. So, okay. So I talked about how now I like skip down the streets of the Bronx, which sounds ridiculous. Ridiculous if you think about it. Um, skipping down the streets of the Bronx with my headphones and listening to Michael Jackson, Black and White is probably usually the song that comes to mind. And I don't care what anybody thinks. I've never, I've not always felt this way. I usually have thought about what people think, and that usually ends up deciding what I do and my behaviors and my thoughts and my, yeah, no, not anymore. It's what I think and what I want to do. And I know that I'm putting out good energy, so it doesn't really matter what people think. Um, and so that experience talking in front of 500 people, standing up, being nervous, being scared, but at the same time knowing this is exactly what I should be doing at this moment in my life. And that this is a channel. This is an avenue for some more change. And it's great. Um, and I had, I woke up with this like crazy energy this morning and yeah, just excited to bring it to my day. But the, the biggest thing here is my life has now changed over overnight. It's been changing subtly. It's been changing subtly. Like little knocks on the door, little knocks on the door. Caitlin, go do this, go do this, go do this. Say this, do this. Um, and so when if you watch any of my other videos, you know that I just kind of say things. Um, but I want you to know that I never plan them. And I just kind of turn on the camera and go. So... My life has changed, and I can't go back. I can't even go back to yesterday at 2 o'clock in the afternoon, okay? The, yeah, it sounds kind of crazy. Yeah, it sounds like, you can't go back, though? Like, what What was so crazy about that moment? I can't, ex I can't describe it, but it was something so powerful that I can't, like, shut up. I can't not say the things that I need to say, and I can't not do the things that I need to do for the world because I, I think that... The world needs a change. The world needs some miracles to happen. And the world needs more smiling faces. And I could just keep going. But be the change you wish to see in the world is my favorite quote. And I'm going to go do that. Um, last night gave me the last push. Like the last kick out the door. Um, put the wings on me. Set me free. I'm going. And I'm doing this. And I'm so excited to share. what I don't even know what's in store for me. But I just have this feeling it's something really amazing and life changing for uh, everyone. So stay tuned for that. And I'll probably be writing a blog post later on today about all of this because this video is already super long, but take home message. Things are going to happen in your life that will change your world and that'll make you feel like you can't go back. But instead of thinking about that as something like not negative necessarily, but instead of looking at that as like, Oh, I can't go back. 
You can't go back. You get to move forward. It happened because you're meant to go on. You're meant to move forward, to move on to something great and wonderful and something that you could have never dreamed up before. And that is a miracle. So, let life... Let life's experiences completely take you through a loop. Take you for a loop. (laughs) Um, Let it change you. Let it inspire you. Let it move forward and let it become, let you become your greatest self. That person that you love. And no, that person does not have to be a size two. That person does not have to eat 100% how everybody wants you to eat or what dietitians want you to eat like or whatever. You do you. And when you feel great, you're going to do great things. And we need people who feel great and do great things. So, All right. <laughs> Happy Friday. Have a wonderful day. And if you have any thoughts, feel free to comment below. All right.